Women's tennis is set to start their 14th season under head coach Barbara Rowski Willette as the Panthers look to continue to grow after a strong 2016 season. Preseason has gone extremely well. They're hardworking girls, every single one of them. The skill level has improved from last year. And on top of it, they just are wonderful human beings. They're kind to each other. They cooperate. It, it's been a great, it's been a fun experience on top of uh, a hardworking experience. Panthers are led by captains Megan Wheeler and Lily O'Connor as they have high expectations not only for the returners, but the seven incoming freshmen. I'm very excited this year about all the freshmen that came in. Um, they show a lot of promising moves and they're really good. So I think this year we have a good chance of winning the whole thing. I think um, a huge part that makes us interesting this year is our seven freshmen. Um, they're all so strong um, and they make up a lot of our top six this year and that's going to be very interesting and I think our expectations this year are to do really well. They bring an, a, a higher skill level than we had last year. Five out of my top six are freshmen and uh, I have one who uh, rolled an ankle is injured right now but all the freshmen have just in, made us a better team and when you hit against better people you can only become better. I'm really looking forward to what our future looks like. Um, with the returners, it was a lot. We knew we had seven freshmen coming in, so I'm really impressed with how everyone came back ready to go and knew that there was a chance that they could take over our ladder. My returners have picked up their pace, have picked up their skill level, and they are wonderful leaders. They have led by example, and uh, things are going great. I think as a program, our expectations are to do well, we want to finish in the top this year. I mean, every year we want to be one of the best, but I think this year we've really got a chance. Our goal is always to win the Little East, but I think we're going to surprise some people this year. If we increase our um, skill level and we're competitive, we might surprise some people and not finish fifth as we were anticipated in the preseason poll. Barbara Rowski willett is in her 14th season as head coach of the Plymouth State women's team here in 2017. As the longest serving coach in the 49 year history of the program. It's been a great experience. I've experienced everything from having no uniforms when we started to going to the NCAA tournament with um, twice with groups of girls. And on top of it, I meet a wonderful group of girls who some in, turn into wonderful women that I continue to keep in touch with. She is my favorite person here on campus. Um, she helps on and off the court. She's always being there for everyone and wants the best for everyone and does everything she can to make sure that we do our best in, on and off, in season, out of season, <laughs> every time. I think overall she brings a lot to the program, a lot to this school. Um, she really helps put Plymouth tennis out there. She wants us in, you know, being shown around campus. Um, she is an amazing coach. She is like one of my favorite people here. Um, Without her, I don't think I would be as successful at Plymouth. It, it has been such a cohesive group and such a work-related re group that they just, uh, I think we're only going to get better, and, and not just the freshmen, my returning people. Everybody is just going to make everyone better, and so the future looks wonderful for us. Women's tennis will have all of their home matches at the Holderness School just up the road from campus this season as they will open at home against Linden State on Friday, September 1st at 3.30 p.m. before heading on the road for five matches to start September. Be sure to check out all the results on the athletic page at athletics.plymouth.edu.